So when you have the pro version, actually you have all the models right over here. Beside the fact that you can choose the pro or the research, deep research model, right? You can go to here and you can choose the rest of the models. And you, inside the pro, you basically have everything. So you can experience with the GPT 4.1 that we know it's, it's available mostly on the API. And recently we added to the OpenAI added to the API. We can see the Gemini, we can see Grok. Right, and we have the latest from Claude, Claude 4.0. So, if you scroll down a bit, you can see that we have all the rest of the model of the reasoning itself. And I mean, that's amazing. The second thing that I really like is the sources. So, you can see we have web, academic, and social, and finance. So, in that case, if I will do this and I will toggle the academic and social, and let's say that I'm going to choose Claude will get the best answer, not just from the web, also from comments. So that's why I really like um, the Perplexity Pro. And you know, it's, it's maybe it's time to think if we really need to pay for ChatGPT and Claude at the same time, maybe Perplexity can close the gap and we can, you know, just use ChatGPT and that's it. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Have a great day.